I just have to start off by saying thank you so much for all of the lovely comments on to the voice and the video and my Instagram and Facebook. Everything has just been blowing up really and uh, I'm just so grateful and humble and uh, yeah, I've just gotten so much love so my heart is very full and I don't want to sound like I'm not grateful or anything so I just had to get that out there to just like to say it because I am um, however I am not feeling my best um, and I haven't for the whole of 2021 so I'm trying to like figure out small steps that I can do to make myself feel happy and I feel like I try to be positive I just feel like I've been so hopeful for such a long time that after Christmas and after New Year's and yeah I didn't have the best Christmas um, so <laughs> I tried to do vlogmas I'm sorry about vlogmas I haven't talked about this but I'm so sorry uh, vlogmas didn't turn out the way it should have turned out I tried but I just think I'm gonna face it that Christmas isn't one of my top holidays um, on the chart I guess and uh, that's okay we we don't have to love a holiday just because it's supposed to be cozy and it's supposed to be fun um, and that's okay too like that that should be okay like you don't have to love something because you're supposed to love it and uh, so I think that's kind of what I've learned like recently that it's it's okay to not like a holiday um, and yeah, I just wanted to come on here and be honest about how I'm feeling and I'm trying to fix it and you've probably seen it as well. I, I've seen it myself in my videos the last, the last year, I think. I started off 2020 super happy, I was in my best mental headspace ever and now I feel like everything has just collapsed, you know. I just feel like that's really sad because I was in such a good place a year ago and now I just feel like I'm back at square one. Um, but it, but it helps, it helps talking to you and hopefully I'm not alone in feeling this way and I just got up this morning just gonna try to kind of take one step at a time tidy, clean, make myself food, like just do one thing at a time and and just kind of be grateful to myself that that's actually something I do and I do it well, like if that's the only thing I can do for myself today I should be proud and grateful and just be happy about that. But the weather is so everyone welcome back to my youtube channel i've been trying to vlog all weekend but it's been very chopped up so i thought that i would just start fresh it's valentine's or it was valentine's yesterday so my friend marie was here uh, <laughs> and no that was not on valentine's day that was the day before valentine's day but anywho i was supposed to buy myself these flowers from work and she ended up carrying them around uh, in the shop when we were shopping uh, and so she ended up buying them and i was like i'll give you money for it that's no no problem but she was like no that's a gift from me i i like doing these types of stuff and she knows I've been a bit down recently or throughout 2021 I haven't been feeling my best so she was like that's a gift from me <laughs> um so yeah that was so lovely I love her oh my god so so blessed that I've gotten to know such a beautiful person through my work I will try to record a little cover for you, cover <laughs> a little cover for you I thought this time I would just sit on the floor you know I uploaded habits um, recently without any notice I just felt like I'm, I'm gonna do this I'm gonna upload it but I thought that in this video then in this video I would sit down and sing a little R&B kind of song I do love R&B so this is kind of, this will kind of be a behind the scenes little tutorial then uh, but I have an interface, the one I use is just this easy Focusrite Scarlett 212, is that what it's called? Um, yeah, anyways, it looks like this, super easy to use. So what I have 
really been wanting to do is to record in Logic and video myself and then add the actual track on top of the video so that it synchronizes. And um, I thought that went really well in the last video. You can tell that I'm stressed, I kind of am. Because um, when I get this over me, anyways, that's how we say it in Norwegian, but when I figure out that I want to do something, it has to happen really quickly because then I'm in the zone of doing it. So that's a weird thing you have to know about me. Shit needs to happen freaking fast. Maybe I need to learn that it's okay that it doesn't happen really fast, but it's super, super convenient if it does. <laughs> I've been breaking loads of stuff in my home recently, so maybe I should just calm my tits, you know? Just calm a little bit down and my life won't fall apart. Like, I have been losing stuff, I've been breaking stuff, and I think that's just a sign that I need to take it slow. I will try to record now. I think, um, a uh, cat is coming over today. I'm just gonna eat some, what was it called again? Cinnamon swirls, because it was cinnamon sun, no, it was, <laughs> hmm, it was, <laughs> oh my god, it was bolle sundag yesterday, which is like a buns sundae or a pastry sundae, where we eat pastries and cinnamon swirls and uh, we just celebrate the, uh, the, the bun sundae really, yeah, that's what I would like to call it. So that's a, a Norwegian thing that we do. Um, so it was Mother's Day, it was Valentine's Day and it was buns sundae or, or bolle sundae. Little fun fact for you there. I've been into doing my makeup recently, it makes me feel good, it makes me feel a lot more happier when I look at myself. Not that I look like shit without makeup, it's just that I feel like myself again, I feel like when, when, when I have my face on I immediately get a lot more happier because I look awake, I can't really see the sadness in <laughs> onto, my, onto my face, because um, I have a little bit sadness inside me, I do. I'm not fond of this Covid world and I don't think any of us are, um, but I'm, ju I'm just putting it out, I put, mm, just putting it out there that I'm not. If makeup helps. I'm gonna do it. And you should too. <laughs> Anyways, I will video and uh, I will talk to you guys later. Good morning everyone. Yes, I've done my self tan as I've talked about before. I'm not a pro, um, but it doesn't look too bad here, but it does look a little bit weird here. However, um, today it's Wednesday and I am just sitting and recording some vocals. like when did I ever do that last time but I just feel like when I've been making these covers up on YouTube and for my Instagram I've just gotten really inspired to just do my own music and work um, online with stuff and people that I write with online so if you remember Jonathan uh, from Australia that I did my co-write with right before Christmas um, I'm now sitting listening to all of the tracks that he sent me because he sent me them in different keys so it's very interesting just sitting here and improvising over it and trying to write a lyric and just figuring out the right key for me. Um, so I just feel like it's, it's very inspiring because I've just thought that writing online is super hard, not efficient. As I am a very sociable person, I love to be in the studio with an actual person. Um, but this is actually quite fun and I enjoy myself. and. Uh, that's a learning process, um, yeah, something I've learned recently, or like, just today, really. Um, yeah, look at my hand, it's so, so done, it's unbelievable. However, I have been vlogging on and off, like, I've been picking up my camera in the morning and then forgetting about you in the evenings, so... Uh, I know that before you watch this little sequence here, I just wanted to put in how I was feeling the other day, how Christmas went, and uh, just talk a little bit about how I've really been, but to be honest, I'm feeling a lot better now, I'm taking care of myself, and I'm doing what makes me happy, back into music, and I do have a lot more hope than I had the last time speaking to you. So, um, 
it's, it's very interesting this and I just have to say thank you for the voice I've probably already said this but the voice is so exciting I've no idea when the next episode comes but hopefully it's not uh, long <laughs> so I will let you guys know and uh, yeah Thing, things are quite good now I feel so I'm very thankful for that and uh, I haven't really done anything other than taking time for myself, I've been reading a little bit, um, doing a lot of covers, not a lot, but I've been recording a lot and I've been singing a lot, which I feel is why I'm in this happy place, because that's that's what makes me happy and I haven't been singing and playing for forever, but now that I've been trying to make covers on Instagram and kind of upload some of it to YouTube as well, I feel like... I'm doing something purposeful, if, if that's even a word, but I'm doing something that's giving me purpose, I feel. And um, yeah, I just listened to my demos uh, last night before going to bed and it's, it's just very inspiring to listen to my own songs. <laughs> and as I told you on Instagram yesterday, um, because I tend, before I post anything on Instagram which is music related and covers and me singing, I'm always so critical, I want it to be perfect. I just realised that people follow me for a reason, that's because they like my voice, that's because they like what I put out, and as long as it is not off key and as long as I'm happy with the music that I put out myself, like the covers and just snippets of what I record, um, they're gonna love it too, like you guys are gonna like it too because you follow me and you've been following me for such a long time um, so I, I'm just very grateful for that, that I'm not getting any hateful comments, negative comments and of course people can not like what you do but at least I'm not getting comments of people saying that they don't like it so um, I feel like we have a very good community on my Instagram and I'm very very uh, thankful for that because I know every everyone doesn't have that on their platform. That's what I wanted to say.